Hello friends, my name is Akshay. You are watching CSE Techs. Let's start. So today we are going to see two problems which were asked in TCS technical and uh, here is the first one. We have to check if the given year is leaf or not. So how? Here is explanation. To check whether the year is leaf or not, step one, we first divide the year by four. Okay. Then if the remainder is zero, then we will move to the step number two. Okay. Then we will divide the year by hundred. And again, if the number is divisible by hundred, leaving remainder zero, we will check our third condition that is in a step three. We will divide the year by four hundred. And if the year is divisible by four hundred, leaving remainder zero, that is the leaf year. Okay. So for that, let's move to the console. Okay, so I'm giving you some time to more note the problem. Okay, here is our third condition. Okay, so we have an variable num which will accept a integer input. Okay, here num is equal to int input enter the num bar. Okay, num. Okay, now we'll apply our first step that is, first condition if if number is dividable by four leaving remainder zero for that num is dividable by four here four okay so leaving zero remainder okay so in this if we'll apply our second condition if number is divided by 100 number is divided by 100 leaving remainder 0 by 100 leaving remainder 0 then we will check for our third condition that is if number is divided by 400 leaving 0 reminder number is divided by 400 is equal to is equal to 0 leaving remainder 0 then we will print print parent the year is the year and whatever the year we uh, enter in the year is leaf year okay dot format num dot format num so else else print the year print the year sorry okay print the year whatever year this will be here is not leaf year okay dot format num dot format num okay so else this else is of that second loop okay where we divide that number by 100 
print the year each the year whatever year and each leap year okay and the last now the last the last one else print in strings the year whatever year will be here is not leap year okay sorry okay so dot format no dot format num okay now let's check it list test it so this is what we want okay run leap year and here is output enter the num here num mean year the year is not leap year okay again we'll repeat it till we got a leap year 2000 okay the year 2000 is leap year okay so this is what the logic is now we have the second problem that prime number with a twist so question is write code to check whether number is prime or not condition use function check we have to use a function namely check to find whether the entered number is positive or negative if negative then enter the number and if if yes pass number as a parameter to the prime this prime is also a function and check whether the number is prime or not okay whether the number is positive or not if it is negative then print message please enter the positive number if it is positive then call the function prime and check whether the take positive number is prime or not so for that there is a short code for this let's start so we will take a variable um, wait let's make a function first okay so we will make a function namely prime having argument n and in that function we will apply a loop a for loop and a condition of if for loop inside the if okay this is this will be right okay so here we will apply the for loop for i in range 2 to n to to n okay so if n is divided by i divided by i leaving remainder 0 then print is not a prime number whatever the n will be is not a prime number n comma n is not a prime number not a prime number and we will break the loop okay so not a prime number and we will break the loop okay so let's move toward the else part 
so else will print is a prime number so whatever the number will be that is n sorry n is a prime number n is a prime number prime number okay so now our conditions are ready so we'll take now an input in variable num num is equal to integer input enter a number int input enter a number enter a number now we'll check again if the number is greater than zero then we'll check the number is prime or not else we will print please enter a positive number so for that here is a condition if number is greater than zero means it is positive so we will check it is prime or not okay else if the number is less than zero means it's negative so we'll print a message please enter a positive number please enter the positive number number okay so let's check it let's test it run enter number 11 11 is a prime number yes 11 is a prime number Yes, 2 is a prime number. Again. Shadow turns to sun rays and the moon